Coming to you live from the Contaminated Dungeon, it's Max the Animal and Nikki Snacks here on Bagels and Locks. Good morning, good morning, and welcome to Bagels and Locks. I am your host, Max the Animal, joined by my partner, Nikki Snacks. What's up? And as always, we will be giving you our best bets for this week's NFL action. Week 17, unbelievable. And it's also 2022. Happy New Year, buddy. Happy New Year, buddy. Happy New Year to you guys. Yeah. 2021 sucked the uh, I should say. Oh, we can do that, Thank you, Mike. We got bleeps. Yeah, 2021 wasn't the best maybe for some of us, but 2022 might be the same because you know what? It doesn't really matter. It's just a day. It, it, don't listen to that bullshit, but we got to say it. For us, you know, mean it's, for a day, it's a year. It's bullshit. It doesn't matter. Like, you know, this is a new year, new me. Nah, new year, say me, because I've been a fucking winner this year. You have been. Two I'm and really one last you. week. Really? Two and one last week. 33 and 16. 31 oh. and. I didn't even look. I don't I care anymore. Just, I'm so fucking good. It's a winner. You know what this says? Winner. Ike, don't put the record. Put winner. Right there, Ike. Right there. That's how I'm starting off the Ike, year. Happy New Year, buddy. Yeah, I, I whatever. meant to actually text you this just, morning, but I forgot. Just Happy another year, day. Um, yeah, you had a bad week last week, but we were going to bounce back. We were talking about it before the show. Next week, we plan on wearing suits. You no, know? no. We will be wearing suits next week. Yeah, we'll see. So, so all right. So, uh, let me just get this out of the way. You have you have been awesome this year. Like, really, really good. Thank you. Thank you. Like, great. And I'm yeah. very proud of you. However, I, I, I can't catch I, I, like, I, don't, I physically don't think it's even possible. But, and, and I'm not worried about that. My goal right now is for both of us, for this show, to just keep winning. The show's success is what's important right now, not yeah. who's winning or losing. So let's go. I mean, it's always that, but let's go. Let's go. Right, it's go. time. Get let's your go. first lock out of the way. All Winner, right. right here. Winner. My first pick of the Just Another Day year is the Chiefs at the Bengals, and we're taking the over. Love that. What's I am um, over 51. Wow. Yeah. Easy. With these two Easy. teams, look, Joe Burrow had a career day uh, last week. He, he threw for a bunch of yards. Patrick Holmes throws for a bunch of yards every week. The Chiefs are a high-powered offense. The Bengals are a high-powered offense. This game, there's either going to be 24 points scored or 75 points scored. There's going to be, that's it. There's no, you know what I mean, right? So it's either yeah, going to no be. In a huge offensive letdown from two of the great young quarterbacks in the league. But I'm not expecting that. I'm expecting a fucking stellar rock star performance from both of these young quarterbacks. Over 51. Let's start the new year right. This other day year. Just another day year. Another yeah. Day. Whatever the f*** that means. Anyway, let's go to me. I'm going uh, to take the Broncos plus seven and a half. That's a, a mistake. Yeah, all right. So so my theory behind this is that uh, he's a Broncos fan. He's told me that the Broncos have a good roster. And I, I truly do think they, they have a good roster. And I, I there's something about the Chargers I just can't stand. They love to blow games, they too. They love to blow games. Yeah. Seven and a half divisional games. Seven and a half points in a divisional game seems like way too much for me. Also... Also, uh, Denver has a really good running game, and the Chargers are oh. one of the. <laughs> yeah, I heard it. Oh. The Chargers have one of the worst rush. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> this, is, this is a disaster already. What happened to the show? <laughs> Power through, be professional. We'll clean it up after the show. I'm not cleaning it up. I'll clean it up, but let's go. All right. So the Chargers have one of the worst <laughs> rush defenses in the league, and Denver runs the ball really well. I, <laughs> I think they, they they keep it within seven and a half points. Denver <laughs> plus seven and a half. You got to be fucking kidding me, man. That's a that's a glass of wine right there. What do I do now? <laughs> what do I do now? 
So you get one paper towel? <laughs> Are you shitting me? Don't give it to me. I'm not doing it. Yes. Are you kidding me? Are you? I wish the camera could see this floor right now. This is embarrassing. Okay, be professional. Power through it. All right. My second pick of the... <laughs> I hate you so much. You owe me a bottle of wine. <laughs> I'm, I'm literally disgusted. No. I hope you die. Who's from? Well, I don't hope that, but... All right. My second pick of the week. We're going to Baltimore, where things are going to get a little crazy... <laughs> I seriously think you should start considering salads. <laughs> I don't even I didn't even see you smoke pop before this either. Right. I did. Right. I did. Okay, here we go. It makes a lot more sense. Racing so much time. I am so fing pissed. Rams at Ravens, minus five and a half, taking the Rams. Uh, the Ravens have been in a downward spiral. The defense gives off. Uh, they give up a ton of points, big explosive plays. Cooper Cup is going to get after it, and so will the Rams. Minus five and a half. What's next? Take it away. Yeah, sure. Uh, it's just disgusting. <laughs> All right. Uh, this is a lot of points, but we're going to New England. Uh, Bill Belichick, I think in the past you've said he destroys rookie quarterbacks, and he does. Patriots are coming off a miserable loss. They're laying 16 and a half points. That is, that, this might be the biggest bet. The most points that we've had in the history of the show. I believe you took the Lions like plus 17. Oh, that's true. Yeah, I'm saying like taking them with the points. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I am expecting the Patriots to beat the Jaguars by 40. And we're going New England minus 16 and a half. Bill Belichick destroys rookie quarterbacks. Trevor Lawrence is a rookie quarterback. I see like a 39-3. Yeah. The Jaguars are an absolute dumpster fire. I, I, I completely love this pick so much that I'm, I'm going to take it twice. Uh, well, I mean, only once. But, you know, what? You, you get the theory of what I'm trying to say. Patriots coming off an embarrassment at home against Buffalo. They need, they need to win this game. They need to win this game. Minus 16 and a half, New England Patriots, the team I beat in the Super Bowl twice. All right. Let's go to the underdog play of the day. Yeah, let's just go there. Uh, hello, welcome to the underdog play of the day. Uh, sponsored by Underdog Fantasy. You can download the app, the Underdog Fantasy app in the App Store, or go to the website, underdogfantasy.com. I'm going to give you my pick and play for the day. I'm going to go with... I'm going to go with... <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> People think I'm f***ing out of my mind. <laughs> <laughs> Little do you know. I'm going to go with Ronald Jones, 69 and a half rushing guards. He's a stud. Over or under? <laughs> no. Over. You know, it over, always over. Okay. Okay. Well, speaking of studs, I'm going to go with Jonathan Taylor. Over 120 and a half yards rushing and receiving, which makes no sense to me. He's going to get that in the first quarter. Good night. Thank you, boys. <laughs> uh, <laughs> this is the most unprofessional I've ever been. I swear. Who would have thought it'd be you, not me? <laughs> oh, I'm gonna fucking pass out. I hope so. You need. Some. All right, good shit, guys. Underdog's fun. Uh, did you hear that sound? No. I don't have any. I lost all my energy laughing. Uh. About that one. Nope. All right, cool. Uh, this one, right? Oh, you hear that sound? Got it. Right over there. All right. right over there. I told you the left ear is better than the right. That means it's time for the big fly. Just a couple weeks left. Weeks left. This thing's holding up nicely. Oh, f your mother. This thing's holding up nicely. All right, so I'll start us off. First big lock of this just another day year, and we are going to head to the south. We're going to the south. 
and we're going to Dallas, and we're going to the Cardinals at the Cowboys, minus five and a half, and we're taking Dallas. Uh, the Cardinals are falling apart. They're, they've been they've been falling apart. They, stink. They, uh, they I don't think they can hold it together anymore. Dallas is kind of picking their steam up a little bit, and uh, they got a high powered offense. They really they do. Dallas has got a good offense. I think they're going to really go after. Cardinals got their wings clipped, and the Cowboys are shining their spurs. You had to read that off the f-ing card. You couldn't remember that, dude. I don't remember anything in the past five minutes. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, so that, yeah, Cardinals get their wings clipped. Cowboys shine their spurs. Mine is five and a half. Dallas, big lock. You can parlay these, but I'll probably go two and one. You know what's going to suck? I'm not even going to throw this. Yeah, don't. I, I don't want it to clean up more. Well, tough sh- has to be thrown. Don't. My big lock. The cameras. I don't really give a fuck. This is, this is your fault, not mine. It's, it was an accident. I, it wasn't an accident. I think you did it on purpose. <laughs> no, I swear. I went to get You're saying st- I have a drinking problem? I mean, maybe. People have problems. You smoke a lot of dope. Just, Why can't I fucking booze? You can, just not not in my house. What do you mean not in your house? <laughs> my house. <laughs> Clearly not. Anyway, anyway, we're uh, we're gonna go over forty five in Indianapolis and Oakland, uh, Las Vegas. That's my big one. The Raiders. <laughs> oh, now you got it. <laughs> yeah, f- me. The Raiders. <laughs> The Raiders' defense sucks. The Colts are a well-oiled machine on offense. Carson Wentz is back. They got JT, like I said, or the underdog guys. One of them said JT over, right? Well, I have a funny feeling that he's just going to run rampant. And 45, that's a number that I just f***ing love. I love it. 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 27-20 Colts over 45. I got nothing else to tell you. If you don't believe, the Raiders always score bullshit touchdowns, too. Always. Derek Carr is like the king of bullshit touchdowns. When he lets loose and chucks it, they fucking... That's it, yep. And then one of them hits or it's a pick six, one or the other. And those are points either which way. Over 45. Colts. Raiders. Rest in peace out, Davis. Uh, And rest in peace, John Madden, too, by the way. Oh, yeah, RIP. And Betty White. Oh, yeah, R.I.P. And Dan Reeves. All right, all right, we got it. Death's we, coming that, three. That's a good one, but we can't just, you know, it's a lot, I mean, lot of people. Piece to all of them. I know, there's a lot of people. You keep going, we could just make it a show. My fourth cousin on my mother's side, fifth removed, is uh, died too, so. Oh, sorry to hear that. Yeah. All right. All right, well, please like, please subscribe. That's the show. Thanks Happy for year. watching. Uh, comment your locks down below. You okay, man? I'm fine. I haven't been able to move, but I'm fine. Hey, those locks. Yeah.